the time in days of old when life was sweet if truth be told when good would win and dreams came My child, I dreamed in Those days are gone. 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 Story. There was a time I used to know when life was fair once long ago. When one could live without pretense and love would thrive and life made sense Those days are gone Those days are gone those days are gone. 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 Remember when it was just the three of us eating mango for breakfast? And what in the world are you doing, Cinderella? I'm just going to pour myself some tea, stepmother. No, girl. You are not ready to have tea. You have not worked sufficiently to use the sacrifices of my labor. Remember that I supply the funds around here, dear. Yes, stepmother. What is here, Lisette? The village voice came up with the list of the 20 most eligible bachelors of 1804. Oh, fresh off the presses. And of course, Prince Carey is number one. That's it, a list. And there was something important. You're such a drama queen. Can I read my book in peace? Oh, the Earl of Yorkshire looks like a delectable match. For whom? You? For you, book lady. Or would you rather live the rest of your life alone in a library? I think that would be just lovely. That's the problem, Lilac. You think! Women are not meant to think. We are meant to do. 
You should not be reading so much. Didn't I raise you better than that? No man will want a girl with crossed eyes and met too many thoughts in her head. Actually, I think there might be a good match for me in there too. Hmm. Did you hear something? Sounded like someone is thinking again when she should be doing chores. Put down that book, Lilac. Come with me. Your elocution lesson awaits. Cinderella, this cup of tea is half empty. On the contrary, sis, I believe the glass is half full. Whatever, just pour my tea. And don't call me sis. Don't let her get to you, Cindy. Positive thoughts. When I wake up in the morning and I linger in my bed, I can dream about what may occur and what may lie ahead. All the people I will meet and the words I'll hear them say. That's the way I start each morning and it helps me through the day to start that way. chores are over and I sip my cup of tea I can think about the future and the way my life may be all the places I will go and the things that I may do that's the way I start each morning and it helps me to get through my everyday sweeps me up and carries me along till I'm dancing with the stars and I know that I belong. Oh, I need to start each morning just believing that I'm stronger with a song. <sighs> what is this, whole milk? You know I only do low fat. Too bad we don't have a low fat cow. Pick up some, will you? While you're at it, can you also pick me up some new magazines and my favorite dress and needs to be taken in for a man with all of these electrical I listen to the raindrops and I hear their lovely song. My imagination sweeps me up and carries me along till I'm dancing with the stars and I know that I belong. Oh, I need to start each morning just believing that I'm stronger with the song and I need to start each morning with a Nonsense. Lisette, come! We are making a trip to the hair salon. And you, you're a mess. Always daydreaming. It's worthless. Clean this up and get on with your chores like I told you. I feel as if nothing I ever do is good enough. I can't even dream around this family. Oh, Papa, why did you have to leave me? Oh, my darling Cinderella, I hate to see your heart so troubled. If only you knew, I'm always with you. I'll never leave you. with you in the whisper
full of the lilies in the rain Always with you In the evenings when you cry And the sunlight when you're smiling once again Always near you When you sing your favorite song And you stop to help a stranger in your path Always near you when you try to make a friend And your pleasure wells inside you till you laugh I've made a vow, oh, don't you see I've never gone away And when you need me most, my dear It's here I'll always be I've made a vow, don't you see? I've never gone away. And when you need me most, my dear, it's here I'll always be. Robin, what's popping? You young folks are always up on the latest news. What does the village voice say? Am I still way up in the polls? Your Majesty, unfortunately, you are way down in the polls this month. That gameplay debacle wasn't too good for the family's reputation. Yes, that was scandalous. Not to mention that Prince Harry has married Meghan Markle. Prince Harry? What? When does this happen? My son, oh my boy, how could he do this to me? <laughs> no, no, not your carry, Prince Harry. Oh, you gave me such a fright, Robin. I could not possibly imagine my son leaving me to wed. You grew up with him, Robin. You know how attached he is to me. Yes, well, at least he has a say in the matter. Feels like as soon as I came out of my mother's womb, I was raised to be a wife. Now it's Robin, get my dinner. Robin, where is my underwear? Always the dutiful wife, when all I wanted to do was run in the fields with the boys and sing. Well, it most certainly will be different with Prince Carey. He will stay at my side, period. Actually, The Voice has published its eligible bachelor list. We cannot ignore it. Prince Carey is number one. I heard it through the grapevine that the people desire Carey to marry. Better not tarry. Very funny. But I'm, I mean, he's not ready yet. to be treated as a guest oh be careful what you wish for for my boy he's my comfort and my treasure it's a joy on him to dote i know what When he's ready for a wife Oh, be careful what you wish for For my boy Oh, let him go 
He needs to spread his wings and grow, let him be He's had enough of you and me, oh let him wed It's good for strengthening your brand Oh let him ask a princess for her hand Oh let him go He needs to spread his wings and grow, let him be He's had enough of you and me, oh let him wed It's good for strengthening your brand Oh let him ask a princess for her hand Oh, when my son decides to marry, he will leave an empty nest. Should it be before I can marry? Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Be careful what you wish for, for my heart. Forgive me, Your Highness, but as your son's lifelong friend, I advise you to hold a bachelor ball so that he may meet all the eligible ladies and choose a bride. I am not in favor of this child, but all right. Prepare the invitations. But of course, she will have to live up to my lofty standards. Yes, Your Highness, I shall announce this forthwith. Hey, Robin, what's that? An announcement for your ball. A ball? Not this again. Robin, how could you do this to me? We're supposed to be friends. How many times have I told you I do not wish to marry? But Prince, it is essential that you marry. The people have spoken. Besides, you'll get to choose the lady you want. You may even find happiness. Prince Carey. You didn't have to marry. Ever since when your father passed away, people were begging for a happy moment. And a wedding could give that to them. True, my one regret is to marry too soon. So part of me says, don't do it. Max! I ask myself, why did I marry? What good has it done me to take on the wife? Said if I'd chosen to tarry, tarry. What would have come of my chances in life? Could I've been following all of my dreams My fantasies fully pursued Like flexing my muscles to burst at the seams Hundreds of ladies have won I asked myself, why did I marry? Why did you marry? What good has it done me to take on a wife? Instead, if I'd chosen to tarry, tarry, what would have come of my chances in life? I might have crusaded with the armor-clad knights to places exotic and grand, and tested my mettle through rigorous fights and clenched the reward in my hand. to answer to no one to tend no one who's watching the clock tick tock no one whose honor i'm sworn to defend no one whose senses i shock i ask myself why did i choose why her? did you choose her if i could go back would i do it once more it's not that i'm willing to lose her it's just it's a lonely have opened one door Who knows what's out there for me? Come one, come all! The Queen invites all eligible ladies to join the royal family in the Bachelor Ball of the Century. All ladies come and try your luck at wooing the young Prince Carrie as he seeks the most eligible woman to become his wife. The festivities shall commence at 6 p.m. sharp. Do not miss your chance to be the star of the ball tonight. <gasps> this is it! My perfect opportunity to become royalty. I must get home and shine up my two gems for tonight's ball!
Oh, not you, Cinderella. Why in the world would you think I was talking to you? <sighs> Finally, the heavens are in tune with me. We have been invited to the Prince's Bachelor Ball. Prince Carrie is in need of a bride, and it's about time. You will certainly find suitable matches at this event. Oh, imagine if one of you is lucky enough to snag a prince. Remind me to tell Miss Cleo that her vision was correct. I remind you, Mother. The prince? <laughs> oh my God, I must prepare. I need a new dress, new shoes, my hair. Oh my God, Cinderella, I need you. On it. Didn't you just get your hair done? I remember when I was your age, I met many, many, many bachelors at the Royal Balls. In fact, that is where I met your father, Lisette. Hello? What about my father? Oh, I met him at the bank, darling. A lady always needs funds. Now it is time to put your years of training into practice, ladies. This is serious business. You need them for income, a girl's got to eat. So what if the outcome is not always sweet? At least you can say you're not a Put up with their tempers at least for a while And always remember to put on a smile You've got to have image, you've got to have style For them, a woman can't make it if she isn't wed No money, no power, she can't get ahead And sometimes I feel like I'd rather be dead But then, I get married again So go to the palace and survey the field And see what your years of fine training will yield You'll size up the prospects and strike while it's hot And then you'll bring home the man
You need them to speed my lucky day. And everything will go my way. At least that once the world will say I'm welcomed. When there's no reason left to cry. And only rainbows paint the sky. You don't let once and I know just why I'm like I told you. I just don't get it. Why is she always so cruel to me? No matter how hard I try, it just seems like nothing works. What am I doing that's so wrong? <laughs> Don't fret, my dear. Who are you? Why, I'm your fairy godmother. My fairy what? Godmother. Fairy godmother. You know, bippity boppity boo. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't really get it. You, you've never heard of me? Wow, that was a blow. I didn't think that would hurt. But no matter, I am here now. I don't mean to be rude, but why are you here? Well, I had a little chat with someone who loves you dearly. One who is always with you. He told me of your troubles. Was it my father? Did Papa send you? <laughs> I think you know the answer deep in your heart, Cinderella. I do feel my Papa's presence. But still, how can anything change? I haven't had much luck these days, and, and truthfully, I don't see how anything is possible without... And I know it may sound crazy, but without some magic. <laughs> oh, child, you have a lot to learn. <laughs> you must dig deep inside your heart, Cinderella, and find your strength and your beauty. Because until you love yourself, how will you ever find love in the world? The answer's not magic, Cinderella It's not about a lucky day it isn't just dreaming till your dreams come true The dreams are friends and they can comfort you It's not just a prince in shining armor Or fairy tales from long, long ago It's living each day, minute by minute Finding your way, strength lies within it Taking a chance Making the room to grow. It's living each day, minute by minute, finding your way. Strength lies within it, taking a chance, making the room to grow. The answer is not magic, Cinderella. Not magic. It's not a Just dreaming till your dreams come true The dreams are friends and they can comfort you It's not just
just a prince in shining armor. No. Godmother. I really needed to hear that. Goodness! Look at the time! We must be getting ready! Ready for what? For the ball, silly! Oh! <laughs> but I don't have anything to wear. Well! They don't call me! Fairy Godmother for nothing. Oh my! How do I look? Exquisite, my dear! Your papa would be so proud. Do you think he's here? Right hmm. now? Close your eyes and feel his presence. My... How they grow up so fast. Nothing but the very best for you. Now, red shoes or... Yeah, that is for a different story. Hmm. Glass, it is. Fairy Godmother, these are absolutely beautiful, but how will I get to the palace? Hmm. I can think of something. What? seen anything like it. <laughs> oh, fairy godmother, how can I ever thank you enough? Mm. Now for the bad news. At 12 o'clock midnight, everything about Dustin will be undone. It's crucial that you remember the time and leave the ball by 12 o'clock. I'm sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> At 12 o'clock midnight, everything we have just done will be undone. It is crucial that you remember the time and leave the ball by 12 o'clock. Okay, I got it. Thank you, Fairy Godmother. Oh, please. Call me Linda! We are strangers no longer. <laughs> Thanks, Linda. <laughs> They're all trying to be your wife. Oh, ridiculous. Throwing themselves at a man like that. Presenting mm. Lady Agatha Etherington. Age 22, 5'5", five five, a cancer, loves puppies and long walks in the meadow. 
and she shows a lot of ankle. Scandalous! Would you look at that? I'd rather not. I feel the same exact way. Did you see her hair? That cut was so last season. Do not fret, girls. The competition cannot hold a candle to you two. I'm not fretting, mother. As I said before, I'm not looking for a husband. You don't have to look for him. If you're the one, he'll mm, find you. You're so right, sis. So how do you know you're the one? Announcing Miss Daisy Bubberton. 35, divorced, no children, ready to get back out there and find her true love. What do you think of her? A little too old, don't you think? Old or not, I'm still not interested. That's why you're my son. Finally, presenting Madame Victoria LaRue and her daughters, Lilac and Lisette. Stop! You're not getting his attention. What do you think of LaRue and her crew? They're an interesting bunch. And now we dance. He didn't even notice me, Lilac. There are dozens of guys here, you said. I'm sure you will find someone else besides the prince. What about him? Now, now, girls, before you go grabbing any random man, remember all that I have taught you. We know, Mother. I'm done with Mother. Prince Carey, who would you like to dance with first? The blue dress girl? Or the one with the scary looking dad? Or her? Hmm. She, uh, she looks like fun. Whoa! Hold your horses there, Max. Our guy can't go dancing with any old girl. He's got to scope out the field, weed out some of the candidates, pick out the roses. He's looking for a wife. And you know as well as I, there are particular things to keep your eye open for. It's wise that he investigates the whys and whens and wherefores of romance. There's nothing that will seal his fate as tightly as a wedding date. So, Maximus, please do not take a chance. Is she subservient? Is she obedient? For surely that's must be in ladies made ingredient. Yeah, she must know her place, be ever dutiful, and do not fail to see that she is simply beautiful. Before you set her on a mate, and holy vows you consecrate, be sure to put the fellow to the test. For as you choose your candidate, and you begin to celebrate, Ask yourself these questions I suggest. Does he admire you? And will he place you first? Does he inspire you and for your kisses no slippers? And can he take a joke? And does he laugh at yours? For men who cannot laugh are always monumental bores. Oh, ask yourself if he is missed Right. Before you choose your bridegroom here tonight. 
Lift herself as she is really right Before you choose your wedding mate To Excuse me, miss. Are you all right? You seem lost. Oh, yes. Forgive me. I I'm not familiar with these events. Well, actually, I didn't think I would be here. You wouldn't have missed much, to be honest. A lifetime of these tacky balls and they still bore me to tears. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to hear that. I'd be more sorry for the Duke of Leicester over there. You see, last week he discovered that the dear Duchess had run off from his estate with all of his money and a dashing young Frenchman. You see, he smiles now, but he'll be alone tonight, poor thing. My gosh, that sounds awful. That's the thing you see in royal life. A facade of perfection, but a certain sadness underneath. You're... royal? Uh, no, 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 no. I I'm just here for a friend. He always drags me into these things. Mm. <laughs> I see. Well, you know, you don't have to force yourself to be somewhere you don't want to be. Let's just say my dear mother gave me no choice. <laughs> I understand. I have a difficult relationship with my mother as well. Well, stepmother. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, at least I'm here. The atmosphere feels a lot better in here. I'm happy you are. Your presence here makes tonight almost... pleasant. I, I love, love this, this song. song. <laughs> <laughs> May I have this dance? Just one look and she's standing there The one who's meant for me Oh, I hope this is real Cause the way that I feel Is what love ought to be Just one glance and I know it's her, the smile upon her brow And if she could love me, oh how happy I'll be She has found me somehow Just one dance and I know I'm free no searching yet to do I could tell from the start She's the key to my heart I thank my lucky stars It's true That the lady of my dreams is you good dancer. I have a really good partner, mademoiselle. Just one glance and I know it's him, the smile of Searching yet, yet 
start. She's the key to my heart. I thank my lucky stars. It's true. of my dreams, of course. Really? Where is she? Who is she? That's just it. I don't know. She left in such a hurry. Carrie, hold on a minute. I have to find her, Max. I must find her. She's the lady of my dreams. Yo, that was a good ball. Am I right? Oh, yes, um, it was. Maximus, have you spoken to Prince Carrie? There was a beautiful lady in a hurry and one of her shoes fell off. It's pretty dope and sparkly, my man. See? Ah, uh, oh yes, she was a dreamy. Hello, Earth to Maximus? Oh, sorry, yes, um, with the girl with the glass slipper. Yeah, she never gave us her name. Oh my gosh, she completely ghosted him. <laughs> <laughs> Would you just be quiet? You're driving me nuts. Is this the lady shoe prince? It was on the bridge. Yes, this is it. We have a clue now. We must go from door to door until we find her. Why don't you chase your love tomorrow? She must be sleeping by now. No, it can't wait. We must find her now. I can't lose her. Who was that girl who lost her shoe? She looked so familiar. That shoe was was very petite. Whoa. Wait a minute. One of you girls has got to fit that shoe. It must be me. There is no one else who deserves the prince more than I do. Aren't you excited to try on the shoe, Lilac? Nope. Be my guest, sis. I'm tired of mama and her. Girls, you have to do this. Girls, you have to do that. Girls, do your makeup. Girls, do your hair. I had to get out of here. Exactly. I need to be free. <sighs> have a change of scenery. Out from under her thumb. You get me, sis. No, I mean literally. Out of here. I don't want to be here when they come with the shoe. not try on their shoes when they come calling I just keep my turn to you I'm too young to marry I don't want to be a wife I'm happy with my single way of life sister you're crazy it's 
all I think about each day. See, getting married is my chance to get away. I need that golden slipper to fit me. How different we could be How different There's not one matter On which we can agree You're a couch potato I'm his personality Then you can have that slipper Yes, I'll take that golden slipper Cause yes, I know that, that slipper fits me slippers Perfect me Okay, this is showtime. Cinderella is locked in the attic. Come on, everyone, it's right across the square. We must get ready. Put some Vaseline on your feet, girls. Shoe fly shoe, show me the magic. Find the foot that fits like a glove. Do fly do, find me some magic. Find the slipper in the name of love. Shoe fly shoe, show me the magic. Find the foot that fits like a glove. Do fly do, find me some magic. Find the slipper in the name of love. Going door to door till my legs are sore Leave no stone unturned and no bridges burned Every village street in the pounding heat Off the beaten track, oh my aching back Shoe fly shoe, show me the magic Find the foot that fits like a glove Do fly do, apply me some magic Find the slipper in the name of love Shoe fly shoe, show me the magic Find the foot that fits like a glove Do fly do, buy me some magic Find a slipper in the name of love Heart and soul are fine in stormy weather shoe to try on. The sun is already rising. Sheesh. Trialy set. She's the one. Soon you'll see this game is done. It doesn't fit. Then you make it fit. Ladies, last call to try the shoe. Lilac, sit. It must be you. Nope. And who are you, lady? Excuse me, Mama LaRue is the name? I'm the woman who's gonna turn you into a frog if you don't get out of my way. Come, Cinderella. Cinderella is just a servant. She is not worthy of royalty. Madam, do not tempt your fate while Prince Carrie seeks his true soulmate. 
It's her. It's him. Cinderella, what an exquisite name. May I? Of course. Just as I suspected. My heart is never wrong. Hmm. She cannot wear one shoe without the other. Rippity boppity boo. So, do you think you can bibbity bobbity boo me a husband? Cinderella. Cinderella. I've never seen my son so smitten and happy. I guess I could live with it. <laughs> thank you, your highness. And, and thank you, fairy godmother. And you, papa. Always with you. Yes, I've always cherished you, my daughter. Did you hear something? I thank you too, Fairy Godmother. And you, Papa, for bringing this wonderful lady to me. And you to me. It's a match! The answer is not magic, Cinderella. Just a princess in shining armor, no. or fairy tales from 